Deep Down Cleaning, your one-stop cleaning outfit for Deep Down Results. John Moore reporting for SportsAndMore.com. I'm joined by Valley Wildcats rookie Tristan Bowlby. And uh, Tristan, maybe we can uh, talk about uh, your season. You have moved on to the Nova Scotia Major Midget Hockey League after an outstanding year last year in the Valley High School circuit. But uh, tell me about uh, tell me about the first month for you with the training camp and now that we're into the regular season. Uh, it was good. Uh, the only very difference I noticed from high school to uh, Major Midget is this, like the speed around the net, there's not enough or not much time compared to high school, and got to make your decisions a lot quicker. And some are surprised uh, with your start. Uh, how difficult did you think it would be to make the transition to this league? And and are you are you pleased and satisfied with your start? Uh, I thought it would be a little different, the speed and uh, the time with the puck and all that and all that. But uh, I'm pretty pleased with how I've been playing so far. Yeah, so. It's been going well. Definitely started to come up more in a nice, uh, couple years of high school hockey. Played, you know, got a lot of ice time, so it was more, more points. And I, know I think high school made me a better player, for definitely. Yes, the, the intensity level and the speed of the game at this level is a bit different in high school. And don't get me wrong, there's a lot of good players playing in the high school league. Uh, it's just maybe the habits that maybe you learn and, and when you're being in, uh, around an environment that is intense all the time. So when he came out to camp, we certainly knew who he was and saw the stats that he put up, but we had never seen him play as a player. So we were unsure of what he was going to bring to the table. And uh, from the minute that he stepped on the ice from uh, the first shift of the game, he was going as hard as he can, forechecking, finishing his checks, playing strong physically. And, and, uh, Is this a league you've always wanted to play in? Uh, I never really thought much about Major Major until this year when Jeff called me or in that. But, yeah, now I like it, and I wish I might have played here a couple years before and all that. Did, so you had reservations? It wasn't something that you necessarily thought that, that, that was this was the place for you? No. I was planning on playing my grade 12-year high school, but... Then I decided I might as well come here, see what it's like, give it a shot. That's a great guy, and I like the group of guys on the team, and everything went well, and everyone's good to each other. So, it was what what might he might you know, what kind of offense might he be able to create here? Well, you know what? That's he's certainly offensive flair. What we were, I will say, pleasantly surprised with is his uh, commitment to two-way hockey and uh, back checking and finishing his checks and uh, being physical. Uh, I think a lot of the times, if you're a pure finesse player then maybe you lax in some of those areas, and he's a complete player. So it's not only his offense, it's uh, his physical game, and that's a rare combo to have that physicality and that sort of finesse with the puck. So uh, we're very happy to have him there. You're a rookie in the league. Uh, obviously, there's going to be a period of adjustment, but what do you, what do you want to accomplish this year? Uh, i just like to put up good numbers, maybe give myself a shot of playing junior hockey next year. I never thought that playing high school or anything that I get a shot at junior or any of that stuff but maybe after this year major midget that could be a possibility for him and certainly in the plans for us to help get him there as, as all these players but him for sure it may be a great opportunity for him to come back and realize his dream uh, of playing at that level so uh, we're really happy that he's on board and happy to help him do that